Okay, the next tile I'm going to show you how to make, the next tangle, is called bales. And bales is similar to floors that it's based on a grid. So just like you did in floors, you're going to make a grid. And when you're making your grid, try to have it so you're making squares as close to them as you can. Okay, so I've made a grid. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start at one intersection and I'm gonna make a slightly curved line to the bottom of the next intersection. So I'm gonna jump down, curve out just a little bit and then go back in. I'm gonna go up to the next one and do the same thing. Curve out and then go back in. Okay, so now I've done all of those sides. I'm gonna switch over to the opposite side and I'm gonna curve out and back in. Okay, now I'm going to turn my paper and I'm going to do the exact same thing I did again, going from intersection to intersection, one side and the other side. So it's almost like you're making, I suppose, like a four petaled flower. This is one of my favorite ones to do. Okay, so when you're done, you have the grid in there, but it's kind of hard to see now because you have it um, covered with all these, you know, these arches. And what I think is really cool is that these arches now form like circles, orbs. Okay, this one is called bales.